Yeah, I don't like golf that much. I don't understand golf. I like mini golf. If this was mini golf story, I'd be perfectly down. But actual golf is like... Okay. Hello, are you interested in a challenge? I doubt you'd offer much of a challenge. I'm currently undefeated on this simulator. You guys have a golf simulator? In a manner of speaking, we don't need the fancy technical stuff. Heinrich here can read ball flights as good as any computer. His dad works for the company that makes them, you know. Watch. Good shot, mate. That one carried about 280 yards. Middle right of the fairway. Looked like it went to the left to me. Your club path was one degree in to out. Swing plane was even. Club head was delivered at an impressive 120 miles, 25 miles an hour. Mind if I have a go? Go ahead. Well, uh, I, okay, I'm just supposed to go with, uh, power and accuracy. I guess I won. A good effort. Car Wait, no. Heinrich. A good effort. Carried about 150 yards. Landed in a bunker. It went way further than that. Cha, cha, cha. Shit, I can't do my fake German accents without uh, <laughs> bird around right now. That one definitely went left. It started left. No. Uh, my name is Heinrich. And un, 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 Okay. It started left, but came... No, I can't do it. It started left, but it came back in the middle of the fairway. Nathan has an uncanny ability to work the ball in either direction. I give up. I want to do a fake German accent, but I'm actually too tired for it. Are you sure you should be standing there? If this guy hits a slice, he'll be in trouble. I never slice. Be the club. That pitch next to the flag and stop dead. It looked like a giant hook to me. Silence! I can work the ball in any direction I choose! Behold! Good shot, mate. Went about 300 yards. Yikes! Maybe don't tell me anybody, uh, tell anybody about that. Let's just say you won this little challenge. I managed to defeat all of Coach's students. When he hears of this, he'll have no choice but to train me. Let's not talk about what went down here. I think I need to be recalibrated. Yeah, I... I unfortunately, I, I think I've just been going too long, so like my ability to fake accent right now is just broken. Well, let's go find out where Coach is. There he is. Hi, Coach. You have no place calling me Coach. Oh, but I think I'm about to. I just bested all of your students. You did what? So will you train me now? Well, what? You have the prospects of a flop shot out of thick rough. Is that good? I wouldn't take that shot if I were three down with two to play. What does that mean? It means your game will always be up and down. And I'm not talking about your short game. Come on, coach, just give me a chance. Let's be honest, I'm on the back nine here. I don't have time to waste on a new student who will either give up or fail to show promise. What are you trying to say? It's a no, kid. Fine. I'll succeed on my own. Listen. The pro shop's open now. Go play a round of golf on the, the course. And bring me your scorecard, and I'll have a look at it. Uh, and if it's good, you'll train me? No, I'm too busy. But I'll have a look. Thanks, coach. I told you not to call me coach. Sorry, coach. Sorry. Yeah, you'd think he would uh, realize that the, his students are beyond garbage. Okay. Yeah, no, I... I, I want to get that fake German accent down. I'll give it to somebody else and, and actually do it properly. I think right now my brain is just too melty for it. I went the wrong way for the pro, pro, isn't it? If I was the kid, I'd just find a new guy after hitting the guy with 50 golf balls. <laughs> just brain coach. Um, to the point where he's like non-functional and then find somebody else to teach me. <sighs> I do almost wish there was like a easy difficulty for me <laughs> on this game. I'm just terrible at, at timing those things. I'm sure if I played the sport, I could eventually get the hang of it, but actually trying to, like, hit the 
A button presses and just... I'm, I think I'm always just gonna get mildly, like, zonked out for it. Anyway, to the driving range. Well, if the pro shop's open, can I just go in? So I can. Inspect. Basic discs, not frisbees. Oversized irons. Plus 10 yards, reduced miss penalty. That's... Actually pretty useful. Okay, let's get the oversized irons. Let's also get basic discs, not frisbees. Is that for, uh, like, frisbee golf? Or disc golf or something? Disc jam? Yeah, disc golf. Welcome to Wellworn Grove. You can play a nine-hole round. Not sure why you'd want, though. The course is in terrible shape at the moment. Want to play around? Hell yeah. Yep, and you need them for the plot. Good to know. Okay. So we're pretty much just blasting it as far as we can as far as we can go. So par 4. So the wind is against me and the slope is slight. I'm going to overshoot this one kind of hard. was kind of expected. Okay, so that's the putter. We do not want the putter. We've we've learned the uh, the sad reality of our, our situation. And what happens to me when I when I try and go hard. At least we got the accuracy. Damn it. Okay, you can putt with long range and precision mode. I'm aware. Um, you shit. Right, because the slope is slight. There we go. Okay, we get a bogey. Oh, I'm still using my old irons, aren't I? Can I, like, um, can I start over? Let's retire this one. I gotta equip my my irons. Oh! That quits me out. Okay. Well, that's fine. Let's try this again. Cause yeah, I didn't even I didn't even think I was using my Oh. My oversized irons. So we've only gotten the uh, oversized irons. I'll take it. But yeah, I'll pay more attention to the, the fact that there's a hill. Once again, it's hard for me to kind of conceive of the fact that there is a there is a hill in this game because we've got um because this is a 2D game, it's gonna mess with my brain because uh, I can't see it. I'm a very visual kind of guy. That said, uh, I think I'll do this a little bit better now that I kind of understand what I'm doing. Let's just go with this. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to have to worry about it this time around. Did the wind change? I think the wind was actually pointed a uh, different direction last time. There we go. Okay. There's a birdie. That This will make life easier. Okay. I can do this. And then I think I will stop. So we'll just, we'll do, just do this course. Yeah, I'd like to get enough money for a proper set of woods, too. I don't know, know about butters. I mean, honestly, I just want to replace all of my, uh, all of my shit if I can. Okay, par, par four again. So this is putter. We don't want to do putter. Oh, right. I forgot I can do a low range mode. Okay, no more. 
And there's a slight slopage down one direction. Birdie chance. Okay, so we want to kind of slope it this way. There we go. Got it. Yeah. I can kind of... I can kind of properly do golf. Holy crap, this is a nine-hole course. All right, well, we'll be fine. Interestingly enough, it's pretty much every course that we've done so far. Okay, so this time I've learned the course is out here. Not the drink, not the drink, no! That, okay, that gives me a penalty. Good to know. So, I'm dumb. But, I learn, I improve very slowly. This is a par 5. And I got a pair of birdies leading up to this. Okay. Well, accuracy is good. Hell yeah! Mega birdie! What is a mega birdie? Oh, it's because I've got multiple birdies. Okay, what does change? Oh, so I can see my my score or something like that. Is an 18 a normal golf course? I have no idea. This is honestly the most exposure I've ever had to golf. I mean, that's maybe a bit over-exaggerating it, but I don't- I do not play a whole lot of golf. Nor do I watch any of it. I always figured golf was kind of boring. Balls? No? Yes. Okay. An eagle would be good. Unfortunately, my chance of getting an eagle here uh, just died. But that's okay. I wasn't even paying attention. And we got it anyway. We get another birdie! Nonsense birdies! Yeah, I just zoned out when I was going to hit it. Well, I am... I am very, very consistent. Almost to a weird fault. Okay, so we actually want to aim for the edge of the mole here. Just the edge. Because... This will get me past the mole. Land me right between the two of them. Wana wants to be a bird so bad. Pack! Oh. Huh. Oh, that's gonna end me in the rough. Or the drink. Blech. Well, you know what? I have seen worse. I have been worse. I have done far worse. And we tip the tree. Ah, uh, bunker? Wait, really? That counts as the bunker? Holy shit. I don't even... Well, are you shitting me? Uh, this is... Not my proudest. Double bogey. Well, that offsets my birdie, birdie nonsense. Still, close enough. I'll be able to do it someday. I'll be good at golf. I believe in me. Believe in the me that believes in the... Well, me. Alright, so if I do this, this might not go well for me. Haha! -ha! Suck it! You weird goddamn mole. I skipped your shit. Okay, so if I do that... Yeah, you know, that's probably actually the best, uh, best possible outcome for me. Probably have given it a bit more forward spin. Whatever. Back to Birdie Man. 
Uh, what do the moles do? The moles, uh... The moles take your ball. And they put it in the, uh... Back in the bunker. In the... In the muddy spot, which is kind of a nuisance. Okay. I wonder if there's like a super long range version of hitting. Probably not. Like, this really is. I guess using the woods is the long range version. Oh, those are benches there. I thought there was like a new UI element that I had to be worried about. Well, if I do that almost perfectly. Nope. I'll end up in kind of vaguely the right spot. Kind of not. Deep rough. Ooh. Ooh. I, um. What the? Huh. Well, this is a bit of an oversight. What the fuck? I think I might be screwed here. I think I might have actually hit a bug. Okay, there we go. My ball was actually inside the tree. Um, which did not help matters at all. Ugh, triple bogey. And then I didn't properly account for hillage. Well, that's okay. I got an oob. <laughs> I am sticking par. Birdie, 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 bogey, bogey, bogey. But getting stuck inside of that tree was like, that's not okay. Uh, there's that... There's no way that, um... There's no way that would... I mean, I guess it could happen, in, quote unquote, in real life, but still. Uh... Okay, green is out here. Except for it's grayed out. It probably has a chance. Or it's gonna wangle off the tree. I'll take it. being ultra low okay I don't really understand what I'm doing but birdie yes I really am just the birdie the bird the not quite bird catcher Bleh. well I mean I can booger this one Really need to. No double booger, though. Double booger will be a uh, problem if it happens. But I believe in myself. I believe in myself at least a little bit more. I really am the bird golfer. Oh, hey. It's underpowered a little bit just because my proclivity is to uh, send it wildly past where it should be. Like I said, proclivity to send it wildly past where it, where it should be. I don't know. Damn, yeah. birdie, the bird golfer. 
Birdie, 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 birdie. Not so birdie. Birdie, not so birdie. Birdie, birdie. How do I get home from here? Shit. Well worn scorecard. Wanna play around? Nah. I wouldn't play here either. Well, we've already bought what we could. My goal, my inevitable goal with that course is to birdie the shit out of it until there's, I can't birdie anymore. Let's go see Coach. Turn in our card. And then hit him in the face with a golf ball. As is our custom. That is weirdly consistent though. I guess not that weirdly consistent. Okay, he was in here? No, he was not in here. Shit. Where'd he go? There he is. I'm a pro. I won't complete for a, a compete for a club of miscreants. You told me this place was improving. Come on, Max. Just hear me out. Your presence will attract a higher class of members. Members will pay membership fees, a portion of which will eventually find its way into your pockets. You've really let this course go. Just look at the caliber of people you have here. You talking about us, mate? Who else would I be talking about? Mate, I've got a robot vacuum cleaner. I read an audiobook a week, man. Congratulations to the both of you. I was never here. What was that about? Oh, it's you again. That was Max Yards from the Pro Tour. I was giving him the chance to represent us. In what? The owner of Lurker Valley and I have a little competition each year. We bring in our best prospects to compete in challenges. Give me the deal! I'll represent Well Worn Grove. But Coach tells me you show no promise. Oh, really? Then what do you say to this scorecard? Let's have a look. Hmm. It's okay. Actually, fine, I'll tell you what. Maybe you could do something for us. Go to Lurker Valley and do a bit of snooping. Find something that will give us an edge in the comp. Lurker Valley? Oh my. It's time to venture beyond what- Is it time to venture beyond while we're in Grove? I won't let this club down. I'm going to. Oh, hello there. I heard you scheming with Lucky in there. I can't have you getting any extra training in without me. I'm going to win the comp myself. Because unlike you, I actually earned my way onto the team. Okay, let, let's go. I'll meet you there. This is a neat and very weird game. I thought I leveled up. I guess I did not. That's really confusing. <laughs> It'd be hilarious if I just, like, converted to one of their members instead. Just to be- just because. Let's save and quit.